Hello, and welcome again to another day of classes. Today we're going to be continuing with the Interchange 5th Edition Level 3, the Green Bird, and today we're going to continue with the rest of the Unit 9. In the previous class, we were talking about, you know, discussing professional services, get or having things done, but today we're going to make suggestions. That's going to be also the grammar for today. But before that, we're going to be having this word power. It's going to be really interesting with the three word phrasal verbs. Usually phrasal verbs are kind of difficult, but if you remember from previous class where we saw the the, gra the, the vocabulary, this is gonna be easy for you, okay? So to start with this, you're gonna match each phrasal verbs in these sentences with its meaning, okay? So take your time to complete this and then we're gonna check, okay? Okay. Okay, you finished? Let's check. Well, number one, Polly has broken up with her bro boyfriend. Broken up means end a romantic relationship with, that is letter B. Number two, Lynn came up with a great idea for a new app for meeting people. That is with letter H, think of or to develop. My brother is looking forward to getting married. He already loves his fiance. Okay, so it's letter E. Be excited for. I can't keep up with all the new technology. It changes so fast. That is to stay in pace with. That is letter C. Very good. Okay. Number four. I can't. Okay, five. Lisa doesn't get along with her roommate. They argue over every little thing. Okay. So that's letter F to have a good relationship with. Okay, very good. Number six, my doctor says I'm overweight. I should cut down on sweets. That is, letter A, reduce the quantity of. And letter seven, no, letter seven, oh my god. Number seven, I can't put up with the noise on my street. I'll have to move. So, it's letter D, it's to tolerate. Put up with is to tolerate. Number eight, I don't like to take care of my own finances. I have an accountant, manage my money, that is letter G, be responsible for, take care of is to be responsible of, if you have four, if you have these answers, very good, you are correct, okay, now let's go to the next part with the conversation, I can't carry a tune, let's listen to this conversation and then it's gonna be something hmm, really related to the grammar for today about making suggestions, okay, so take your time to listen to this as many times as you need, and then we're gonna go straight into the grammar for today, okay? Okay, so let's listen. Page 61, exercise eight, conversation. I can't carry a tune. Part A, listen and practice. Are you going to Lena's party tonight? No, I don't think so. I don't really feel up to it. You haven't been going out much since you broke up with Carter. I guess not. He's friends with all my friends, you know. You need to meet new people. Have you thought about joining a running club? You love running. I've thought about that, but they meet at 6 a.m. I'm not really a morning person. Well, maybe you could take part in our singing group. I've made a lot of good friends there. Um, I don't think so. Remember when we did karaoke? I can't carry a tune to save my life. Yeah, I remember. Well, I guess you'd better get used to waking up early. Just think of all the cute guys who go running in the park in the morning. Oh my god, Emma, you're such a wow. That's great for you. I like that you do that. Okay, very good. So... Do you notice what, what was happening with Emma and Alice? Well, you know, Alice has been feeling not so good because of the, you know, breaking up with his uh, boyfriend. But Emma is suggesting different things. And surprise, surprise, that is the grammar for today. Making suggestions in different ways. Okay, we have with models, with verbs, negative questions, gerunds, infinitives. But, as always... I have a, you know, a material for this, making suggestions. Okay, 
So we have different ways to make suggestions. We have with gerunds, with models, with animals, and negative questions, as we said. Okay, so with gerunds, it's the ing form of the verb. You know, gerunds: walking, uh, jumping, cooking, etc. Okay, so let's see some examples of this. What about looking through the personal ads? Have you thought about joining an uh, joining an online dating service? Okay, you know, it's starting the suggestions with uh, this type of sentence, but then using the gerund to say the thing, okay? We can also use with models like could, with auxiliary helping verbs, plus the verb. Maybe you could, maybe you could go to an online chat room. Maybe you could try an alternative option. We also have the infinitives. It might be a good idea. It might be a good idea to check out those discussion groups at the bookstore. One thing you could do is to eat foods that are better for your health. We also have with the negative questions. Why don't you do things? Okay. Why don't you join a dating service? Okay. I think we, and these are some of the sentences that you can use to start the suggestions and what can be followed with. I think we should, um, why don't we, shall we, and let's with infinitive and what about and how about with Jared? I think we should, um, have a date. What about joining, uh, um, I don't know, a baseball club? How about doing it the other way around? Why don't we see new, why don't we meet new people? Shall we dance with them? Let's eat something. Okay. So these are some suggestions. Okay. We can make the suggestions and also agree it and reject it. Okay. So. To make the suggestions, we can say, let's revise, what about going to, how about going, why don't we go, could we, shall we, what would you say to, did you think it's a good idea to, does it matter if we, would you like to, let's go to, I suggest we take into consideration, we could, do you fancy, we might as well, and you can also agree or reject it, yes, I'd like to, yes, oh, I love to, what a good idea, why not? Brilliant. Yes, with pleasure. All of this yes with different types of uh, things that you said before. After that, count on me. Or in negative, no, let's not. Well, I'd rather do another thing. I don't feel like it. What an awful idea. What a bad idea. Um, I'm not sure about that idea. I'd love, but I love to, but I don't think it will work. I don't think I can. I'm not very keen on helping people. Okay. Okay, now let's go to the book to see with the ones that are there. Okay, with models plus verbs. Maybe you could take part in a singing group with gerunds. What about joining a running club? Have you thought about asking your friends to introduce you around? The negative questions. Why don't you do some volunteer work? Why don't you give me 1,000 passes? Like, for the sake of it. <laughs> With infinitives, one option is to join a club. It might be a good idea to check out the cultural events at the university. Okay? You see, there's lots of ways to make suggestions. Okay? Okay, very good. If you understand this, let's do this really, really, really easy exercise. You know, use circle the correct answers with this. Okay? So take your time to complete this, and then we're gonna check. Okay. Okay, you finished. Let's check. Okay, number one. What can I do to keep up with all the assignments in college? Maybe you could stay in on weeknights. What can I do to get in shape? Have you thought about working out at the gym? How can I save money? Why don't you come up with a budget? How can I learn to dance? It might be a good idea to take dance classes. How can I build self-confidence? What about participating in more social activities? Very good if you have these answers because you are correct. Okay, let's continue. Okay, so we're going to have a listening. Hmm, interesting. Listen to a conversation between three friends on New Year's Eve. Check the resolution each person makes and write their, write their friend's suggestions, okay? 
So take your time to listen, then complete this chart, and then we're gonna check, okay? Okay, so let's listen. Page 62. Exercise 10. Listening. Resolutions. Part A. Listen to a conversation between three friends on New Year's Eve. Check the resolution each person makes and write their friends' suggestions. That food was delicious, you guys. How many years have we all spent New Year's Eve together, Hannah? Five years. I just posted our annual picture. Your mom already liked it, Selena. Of course she did. And now my favorite part, New Year's resolutions. Edward? I need to stop procrastinating on my big project for grad school. I still haven't started it because I get so easily distracted. I've said this before, Edward, but you need to cut down on those distractions. How can you work with the TV on? And your roommate's music? I could never put up with that. I know. It's hard because I get along with him so well, but he is a big distraction. And well, you know how I love TV. Yeah, but you'd finish your project a lot faster without them. Have you thought about going to the library? Work hard for a few hours, then go home and watch all the TV you want. Hmm, that's not a bad idea. I've never tried working at the library. What about you, Selena? I want the energy I used to have at school. Now I'm just always tired at work. I think you need to exercise, Selena. You sit down all day at a desk and then go home and sit more. Of course you're tired. I found this great app that has quick and effective exercises you can do in your living room. Yeah, but she needs to leave the living room. Selena, maybe you could start some outdoor exercise, like hiking, swimming, or jogging. You need to take better care of yourself. I hate jogging, but I've always liked swimming. You swim, don't you, Edward? Yes, and I love it. Why don't you come with me to the pool this week? Push yourself to start exercising three times a week, and I'll push myself to go to the library. Perfect. That leaves us with Hannah, our social media queen. Ugh, I need to come up with an idea to save my relationship. I think my boyfriend might break up with me. What happened? He says I'm addicted to my phone and social media. But it's my job. I'm a social media analyst. I have to constantly be online. Yeah, but you shouldn't be working online all the time, Hannah. Everyone needs a break. What about taking a couple hours off from your phone every night? Every night? Hannah, work is important, but it isn't everything. I just don't want my work to suffer and lose my job. You'll be better at your job if you're not always working. Try it for a few nights. Yeah, maybe you're right. Guys, why can't life be easy like it used to be? <laughs> like when we were 12? Welcome to being an adult. <laughs> Happy New Year! Oh my god, why? Why did we have to become adults? I want to be a child forever, but no, okay. Okay, did you get all of the um, resolutions and suggestions? If not, remember that you can go back in the video and listen to it one more time, okay? But if you did, let's chat. Okay, so Edward is gonna start a project, and the suggestion is to cut down on distractions, to go to the library for a few hours. Then we have Selena, that his resolution, her resolution is to have more energy, and the suggestion is to exercise at home with an app. Do outdoor exercise, like hiking, swimming, or jogging. And then we have Hannah, that wants to fix her relationship problems, and the suggestions are to take a break from work and to take a couple of hours off from her phone every night, okay? If you have these answers, very good, you are correct. Okay, so now let's go to the last thing for today that it's gonna be a reading, as always at the end of the units, okay? So improving the world one idea at a time. Okay, really interesting. Take your time to read all of this and look at the face of this person. I think it's a famous, but I don't know him. I mean, I think it's Jack Andraka or whatever his name is. Okay, take your time to read this and then we're gonna do the exercise below, okay? Okay, if you finish reading, let's continue. You're gonna do these two exercises. 
Read the article and write the number of each paragraph next to its summary sentence. And then you're going to choose the correct answers in these different type of sentences, okay? So take the time to do this, and when you finish, we're going to check. Okay, you finished? Finished? Let's check. Okay, so it's two, one, four, three. One doctor's help makes the unlikely become possible. That's number two. A personal experience creates a groundbreaking idea. That's number one. Family support and passion for discovery can lead to great things. That's number four. And although he won a big prize, there's plenty of work ahead. That's number three. Very good if you have that. And then the last part. Pancreatic cancer is so serious because it is hard to diagnose early. And Raka was inspired to find a solution by an upsetting experience. The responsible to Andraka's proposal was largely negative. Andraka's test for pancreatic cancer is being developed now. Andraka's family helped him by encouraging him. Okay? If you have these answers, very good. You are correct. Okay, that's been everything for today. I hope that you like this class and that you look forward into the next video, okay? But that's been everything for today. So see you in the next time. Bye.